Hey guys, welcome back to some more AFK Arena. In today's video, we got a new redemption code that we're going to give out, and also we're doing a bit of an update on the 530 account. It's been stalled for a while, people have been asking, so we're going to go through that and show you where we're at, and hopefully in the next week or two, I reckon we'll push into and get to do our massive Stargaze session, but let's get into it. Okay, so first up, the redemption code, uh, it's another 1,000 diamonds for us all free, which is nice. Go to the redemption code. I'll leave this in a pinned comment and in the description if you want to check it out. Uh, redeem that, 1,000 diamonds. Hey, free stuff, always good. Can't complain about it at all. Um, we'll definitely take it. As you can see, we're stacking up diamonds on this code. So, you, oh, before we do anything else, daily giveaway chance. Uh, if it's a purple, it's a $20 giveaway. Let's see blue rip okay moving on so if you all you wanted was the code see you later have fun enjoy your thousand diamonds if you get a pull good luck uh for those that have been asking me about the 530 account so basically of late and i've got a video that i've like ready to upload and then i saw the code so i was like we'll do the code but there'll be another video out probably a couple hours after this uh that i've got ready i've basically been pushing the celestial hub gen account really really hard and I've neglected all my other accounts. Like I've been doing dailies and that's about it on all the other accounts. Uh, I have not been pushing campaign and all that stuff. Uh, so this one had been stacking up resources. Uh, I did just go ahead and buy from the shop. So from the guild shop, I have ended up getting three pieces for Kazard. Actually, I should enhance this because he's going to be the man. Let's go to that. That's going to use a lot of gold. But I did pick up that, I did pick up those three at the time, and I also did just today pick up uh, a staff from the guild store, which actually turned out to be, um, to, it's actually a really nice one because it turned out to be Graveborn for the Baden, but eventually with a Graveborn account, you're going to build Pharrell anyway, which means you'll use that anyway. So I'm pumped about that. I already have four Pharrell copies, so he's getting, he's, he's basically getting there. So not too bad at all. Um, let's just actually, I think I have, I have 60 of these. Let's pop that, see what we get. A Warwick. N not uh, <laughs> not what I was looking for on this account. What do we got? Yeah, second Warwick, I guess. Like, he is decent endgame, but, you know, this one we're just playing for fun, so we're not really playing for keeps, but... You know, by the time we get there, we're gonna have we're gonna have a big stargazer session. We've got the new event coming out that's gonna give more Kazards. So I honestly think we will get an ascended Kazard on this account in uh, without taking too long. Uh, but let's have a. I want to do a little bit of a campaign push because since I, I haven't done a push since I got that gear, like I said, been pushing the Celestial Hyper Gen account way too hard. Um, but the thing I'm pumped about this account, it'll it'll give me a good feel of like the Kazard and whether I want to actually go him next after I do like. Like, obviously, I've got twins in my hero, but, you know, I'm trying to gauge what Celestial Hyper Genes I want to work on on my Celestial Hyper Gen account, which is, like, becoming my main account. So, it's a bit of fun to see what we can do. As you can see, we are still... If that Baden was just a Shimira, we, we'd have no issues in the world. It's... it's uh, Baden's not the best early game carry, uh, Is it's safe to say, but he might actually get through this one. He might actually get through this with all the, all the phantoms. Nice. Okay, we like I ha like every day I went in and I'd start that one and I'd try it and I'd always fail. Uh, but I guess the extra bit of gear we got with the upgrades helped out a bit there. Um, the Kazard, like I'm investing in cloth gear at the moment for my guild points for this account, which sounds stupid because Kazard's only elite plus. But like I said, we've got an event coming, which is going to hopefully get me two more copies, which will get him to legendary. Um, then hopefully I can pull at least four copies from the big Stargazer session that we're going to do and get him to mythic. I doubt we'll get into Ascended that soon, but hey, we will take a Mythic Kazard if we can get it. Um, maybe even a bit further, but we'll see how we go because we do have a bunch of diamonds to collect. Actually, let's collect them now and see how many we are actually up to. And we do have some Stargaze tickets. So. I mean, that's not too bad. We should get a bit of... Oh no, we're not, we're not at the stage where we get AFK loot gear either. Uh, let's go here. Uh, let's go to the merchants. Let's actually collect these. I'm curious to see what it ends up with. I could have just done the math, but it's easier just to collect them. I've been letting them sit there for so long. Okay, so 67,000 is not bad. What's that? That's 12. That's 13 10 pulls. Plus we got another 10. So at 14 10 pulls, which hopefully we will end up getting, but we're going to get more uh, from all the quests and stuff as well. 
So it's not looking too bad for this account. Uh, we're obviously not going to compete in PvP and stuff like that with this account because we're just we're just we we pretty much neglected it for too long pushing the other account, and uh, and, and we're we're a bit far behind. But hey, it's a fun account. Um, if you guys are still playing on the 530 account, I want, I want to hear where you're at. For those that don't know as well what the 530 account is, because some maybe, maybe came in late, when the whole lockdown thing started and everyone was home, I thought for a bit of fun we could all just start a 530, an account on the server 530 because it was the next one to come out, and then everyone could get involved and have a bit of fun, um, and then everyone could be on the same server. So everyone's pretty much trashing me now on this server, but I'm hoping in the next couple of days I can actually push it, and if we do get the Kazard up there, um, we might be able to get to some places. I don't know. We'll have to see how we go. We'll have to see how we go. I feel like if I I really invested in this one, I could push it pretty hard. Um, to be honest, I actually do enjoy the Baden. It's just he's not that strong at this stage. Like, I definitely could be doing something wrong, but I feel like he's got the Lucius with him at Mythic, which is really solid because obviously Lucius giving him the shields, giving his phantoms the shields is really solid. But we still do get shredded a lot. Uh, I could probably change it up and take Kazard out. It's just I'm really stubborn and want to use him. Uh, and it's actually a bad team we got going here. Well, let's change this up. If we dropped him and put her in, it'd probably be better. Let's see. Let's see. Will Rowan die? Yes, he will. Just got absolutely destroyed. And with the Taylene, we should have the extra healing and it should be fine. And we get the faction bonus. Oof. Got shredded there, but it's okay. Taylene comes back. It's a bit of heals. I mean, we did have pretty lucky pulls on this account that we got the Taylene and the twins, which is pretty solid. Oh, we're about to get shredded. Come on, don't go bats. Do not go bats. Shimura altered. That sucks for us. Can we kill her? Oh, heal, heal, heal telling. Oh, that was pretty clutch. I think we actually got it. Did we get it? Yes, we got it. Okay. Okay. I find Kazard actually does a really, a real high amount of damage normally. So I'm actually tempted to drop him, which is our only real CC and put Kazard. It gives us like low health CC, but I just want to use Kazard because he's cool. He's got, there needs to, in my opinion, there needs to be more heroes with pets in the game. I feel like pets are, are an integral part to any game and they just make it fun. That's me anyway. I grew up with Pokemon and Digimon. So <laughs> that's my little piece of input for what they should have. Like Kazard's wicked with this serpent. I want to see a mauler, like a cool mauler that has like a tiger that they run in with and like the tiger has its own health bar and goes out and like if it if the tiger gets killed they'll like bandage it and like bring it back i feel like that would be cool even cooler than a tiger would be like a little dinosaur like a velociraptor or something like that or now i'm just getting crazy it's like they have like a tiger or something like that and then their ultimate is like they bring out extra pets to attack I don't know. I, I don't know. We're, we're getting really sidetracked here, but it's just something I've been thinking about because when, whenever I jump on Kazard, I'm like, this is cool. It reminds me of playing like a hunter in WoW and having pets, and I love pets. It's a weird thing I have going for me, so just don't judge. <laughs> don't judge. Ooh, that was a clutch shield by the Lucius. I just want to clear this chapter and get some summons. I just want to clear this chapter. Yeah, we can do it. I reckon we can do it. Because what do we get for clearing the chapter? 10 faction scrolls? What faction we got? Yeah, we'll swap it to Greyborn just for 10. <laughs> Why not? Why not? It's a bit of fun. Okay. Uh, the Shamira is going to be the issue here. The Shamira is going to be the issue. Isabella could be, but I don't think she'll be as bad. Just because we'll have all the phantoms hopefully coming out. The Shamira's AoE and, and the Vidan, obviously, is a pain. Oh, good save, Taylene. Now, Lucius, get your shield, please. Oh, Rowan got just absolutely dropped. Dropped like an absolute sack. Can we freeze them? They get low. Isabella got frozen. There's too much healing going on on that enemy team. There's way too much healing going on. 
Do she shields? Uh, yeah, we're done. Okay. This is annoying. Let's go with it this way. I kind of want to do this way. I feel like if Rowan got saved, if Lucia shield before Rowan got killed by the dam, we would have been good. Okay, Shamira ulting already kind of sucks. Taylene saved. Do not kill Rowan. Please do not kill Rowan. Please, we need him. Damn it. Oh, that Shamira almost died. She almost, she almost took it. Let me see. Can we, can we ascend him any further? Do we have the food? We got one, two. I got the two food heroes. Yeah, we're still short on food. I kind of, I don't want to do more summons. Do we have any stones? We've got a few there. How many Graveborn? Not enough. Not anywhere near enough. Let's auto. Yeah, it gives us one Graveborn. That's 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 not that's not really enough. Uh, how about how about light bearers? Do we have the light bearers food? No, we don't. We're struggling with food in every aspect. So I just want to get through and do these ten, this temple. That's all I want. Uh, let's go ahead and maybe we would just bring the wilder CC team. I mean, we got it built. Why not just do that? Do I have a Lyca? Yeah, I do. Uh, it might not work, but it might. Let's find out. Don't know if they have gear. Who cares? We do lose potions, but hopefully Lucius can heal enough. Lyca's dead, but it doesn't matter. I want to keep Arden alive. I definitely think they don't have gear. Definitely my assumption they do not have gear. Uh, all right, I'm just gonna get this and we'll be back. Okay, we got it. What we had to do there was uh, put it on manual. I did have to put gear on them. They, they didn't all have gear, but I put it on manual and just saved Tassie's ult for when Shimira was about to ult. We did get lucky and kill the Vedan as well, which really helped at the start here. Um, just got all those phantom strikes at the same time. And then we like you can see Tassie sitting at full uh, energy, and we're just waiting for that Shamira to try and ult, and then we're gonna just sleep her so that we don't have to worry about that. And it's GG from there. Okay, cool. Next stage. Let's get these last three stages and get ourselves a decent summon. Uh, we'll put that back on auto. Hopefully everyone doesn't die, which they did, which kind of sucks. It's the Kaz. Uh, you know what I might do? I might do this. I might do it like that and that. That way it just gives Baden a little bit of breathing space. Uh, how did he root faster than us? Don't get that. It's kind of frustrating. Let's try again. Oh, they got a like her as well. Hmm. 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 Okay, what I'm going to do is... I'm going to actually put that on Arden, Jura's Call, and see if it lets us root their Arden first. I think that should be the difference. Let's see. And that cat, he still outspeeds us. That sucks. That's absolutely devastating to me. That's very, very devastating. So, let's go back to this team. Let's put Kazad in. Let's put Rowan in. You know, I might even put some gear on Cecilia. Uh, we can put that back on Rowan. We'll give Rowan this again. I feel like this may work. Man, I need more Rowan copies. Then we're going to put Cecilia in. Back him up there. And see if Cecilia can drop the Arden. The problem is the Kaz. Although the Ka he'll she will distract Arden, hopefully make... They did not take as much damage. And we got we got the potions as well, so that helps too. Stun the Arden, please, before he roots. Perfect. Kill him, Cecilia. Damn, she died. That's okay, because we got Kazar. We got the freezing power. Oh, it's so satisfying when you freeze everyone. That's it. That's what we needed. 
I mean, Cecilia did zero damage, but hey, she distracted and she stunned, and that's all we needed her to do. Uh, let's let's bring the Cecilia out against this. Let's see how she does against the um, the Savius. Like she she'll die pretty quick, I reckon. I was hoping that Rowan would survive. K Source is very annoying because he heals too much. Oh, we might freeze him here. Nice, nice. Kazard get another ult, and we're good. Lucius, don't die, please. Please, Lucius. Look at him surviving. Look at him. Oh, almost. We might struggle without the Lucius, but I mean, Savius does lose a lot of, a lot of his impact when he just keeps hitting the phantoms. Okay, got him. Nice. Let's have a look at damage. Man, Baden actually did well. Savius did a lot, but didn't really hit anyone with it. Boss stage, let's go. Final stage, then we do a temple. Uh, this and this is going to be annoying. Let's try that. No, we might put the tailing back in. I just, I just really enjoy Cecilia. She got dropped really fast. Had zero impact on the battle. But hey, she was cool. <laughs> she was cool. That's all that counts sometimes, being cool. Yeah, no, nah, we're, we're dead here. We are dead. Okay. I wonder if the twins can survive. I wonder if I put him up there and put the twins in. If they can survive. If we can get a haste buff, it'd be nice. Yeah, they just drop instantly. <laughs> it was worth a try. It was worth a try. Maybe we do bring the Pharrell and just give up on the faction bonus. But take the CC. Kazard's dropped. That sucks. I may have to swap Kazard and uh, Pharrell around. Oh, good. The Phantoms got behind... Um, what's her face? Muriel. And actually made her ult backwards, which actually really saved us. And I think we've got it now. Sweet. We'll take it. We will take it. Ramp it up. Nice. Okay. That's chapter done. That's what we wanted to get to in this video. Uh, no, I don't want the pack, but I will take these and I'll take those. Uh, ooh, weeklies, how many we got? Not enough. Not enough yet. I really got to do those. Anyway, let's go check the mail. What do we got there? The patch notes, cool beans. Let's go to the tavern. Let's swap this because we're wasteful. And we want to do a pull. Because why not? Let's go. Rip. You know what? We're going to do a couple couple normal summons. I just want to get a purple. Then we'll save for Stargaze. Free blues rip. Okay, that's it. That's it. We're done. Be a Baden. Brutus, man. It's not what we really want. It's really not what we're looking for on this account. I mean, it does give us the Brutus capabilities to actually take him to... With a little bit more fodder, we can take him to Mythic, but I'm really not keen on doing Brutus on this account. Yeah, that wasn't worth it. That was not worth it. Anyway, that is where this account's at for those that have been asking. That's the redemption code. Uh, let's get into the next chapter. Chapter 15. Once we clear this one, we will have a really, really fun Stargaze session for the Khazard and hopefully getting going. But that is going to be for this one, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day and I'll look forward to seeing the next one. Cheers.